Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins. I am your host, Tyler, and uh, we're playing another one of the Assassin's Creed Origins Deluxe Edition side activities. So this is exclusive with, if you have any sort of pre-order bonus um, missions that the game comes with. We've already done Secrets of the Lost Pyramids, or not, the Secrets of the First Pyramids, uh, which is already up on my channel. You can go check that out. And now we're doing Ambush at Sea, which is a level 28 mission. And it starts here in Crocodopolis, whatever it's called. Is that it? Crocodopolis? Yeah, that's it. So this region here. South of Memphis. Yeah, out here. So the recommended level is 28. I'm 29, so I feel pretty confident. I should be all good to play this mission through. So let's give it a crack right now, shall we? Have you heard the story of courageous Captain Foxidas? The magnificent... So we gotta yes, listen to the storyteller? What was her name? Which battle are you talking about? You have not heard? Oh, my friend, then you are in for a treat. Let me tell you how it happened. Okay, here we go. Oh. Oh, interesting. Are we gonna play the story that he's telling? Oh, he's telling a story about Arya. <laughs> oh, that's great. So we're playing as Arya for this mission. For some reason you don't know, this is Bayek's wife. Who I've only played one mission as, I think, at this point. The noble Greek captain and the Egyptian goddess sailed from Alexandria's golden coast in search of the feared Gabiniani fleet. With only their sturdy trireme and loyal crew against the Gabiniani's fabled warships. Floating mountains, carrying 10,000 men, bristling with oars and fire. Where are these mongrel Gabiniani? So ladies and gentlemen, this is the naval gameplay of Assassin's Creed Origins. So I've only played one Aya mission, which was a naval mission. I had no idea before that mission this was even in the game, so just such so awesome to have naval back in Assassin's Creed. And in a whole new way. Well, we have to stop them before they can join Ptolemy's fleet. You find them, Aya. Send them to ruin. So that's Alexandria. So we're just north North of the Egyptian coast and the Mac coast. That's only part of their full strength. The lesser part by the looks. Trireme's only. There's no sign of their damn octory. This works in our favor. We can work them down. Oh shit. You got hit there. We attack! Okay. Give no quarter, man! These devils will give us none! We have an octary! So pretty much the best way to do anything is ramming and then you're able to shoot shoot these little fireballs at them. Way more freaking loading because it's arrows not, you know, cannons like we're used to in Black Flag or something. Oh shit. Shit. Charge it. Yeah, that's what I want to see. Let's drop it. Let's drop it, guys. Okay, let's ram this mofo. Yeah, ramming's by far the best way to do it. Obviously, it's not because it's so old in time period. Not like Black Flag. No cannons here. No cannons here. Let's take him out. This guy's getting fucked up. Then when we get close, firebomb. What are the firebombs? I don't even know. I've stopped asking questions. Oh, 
<laughs> 29. The four, you mean, but classic storytellers. They prevailed. Just 20 warships. Obey himself would not claim so many. You must not doubt me. I was told it by someone who saw it happen. Captain, we bested them. The Gabignani are finished. Don't be hasty, boy. My spies gave me a greater number than that. They must have split their fleet. We should head east. Straight into the jaws of the crocodile, if your spies tell the truth. Ha <laughs> ha What of it? As if rising from the very depths of the underworld, a second bristling wall of hulls appeared. This time, an unbelievable 40 Gabiniani death ships faced our lone heroes. Then another ship oh, behind shit. the fleet, What's the size of which has never been seen before or since. Ten thousand warriors crowded its massive decks. Let's go. Let's do it. You guys are fucked. <laughs> I love this. This is great. One hundred balls of fire leapt up from the Gabiniani decks and bore down upon one hundred balls of fire. Through all three at a time. If I gave him enough time, there might be a hundred in total. But I'm not gonna let that happen. Charge! Get him! How many more ships can there be? This must be the fault out of these bastards! There! Gods and beasts! Citizens and slackers! We win! Or we die! I think we might be dying, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna, like, move out a bit, actually. Because it's looking fucking dangerous. Turn this. We're gonna have to go hard for this or we're fucked. Or we are fucked. We got him! Oh shit, we got him! Oh no, we died. Okay, never mind. Take two. Okay, let's get out quicker and do another turnaround. So we can do a final ram. Before we're at really low health. Oh shit. Will we? 
with their tears running down their face. The gods themselves will lift up to our glory. Can of fire. Steady, old man. Let's not beat the gods. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, guys. We're low health. Oh, well, that hurt him. Oh, not really, actually. It didn't do fucking much. Fire! Fire! Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. I'm still trying to steer this ship. Oh, fuck's sake. Okay. Fucking hard. We got him! Oh, we got him that time. <clears throat> we were uh, so close to dying. I was freaking out. I was really tense. I was very tense then. Ah, la, la. Okay, no. Whew. Oh, that freaked me out a lot, actually. I feel better now. I feel much better now. Foxidas and the goddess sailed into legend over the backs of ten times ten thousand drowned Gabiniani. <laughs> I tell you, I weep just to tell of it. And they say, if you whisper a prayer into a wave or a fold of the sea, you can hear their war cry answer back. Alala! Alala! And that is how it happened. To a word. <laughs> what a tale. If the goddess' name was Aya, and a goddess she truly is, that may be the only honest part of the story. What is truth? All is permitted in the realm of greatness. One must believe in the act of creation, or else they will join the Gabiniani. You are a fine storyteller, Seni. Though, I cannot tell if you are playing a game with me, or telling a story. They are one and the same, my friend. Married to each other, like the oceans and the rain. Alala! You see it now! <laughs> <laughs> oh, funny. Well, that was a fun mission. Any chance I get to play some naval gameplay in Assassin's Creed, I'm all for it. And that guy's a funny storyteller. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank you watching this side activity video of the bonus mission ambush at sea i hope you enjoyed it let me know what you thought down in the comments below uh leave a like as well in this video and subscribe to the channel if you're new and i'll see you next time for more assassin's creed origins